Thousands of residents in the Sydney suburbs were told to evacuate their homes on Sunday after heavy rain caused floodwaters to rise and rivers to overflow in what authorities called life-threatening emergencies. The Bureau of Meteorology issued a severe weather warning for heavy rain and flash floods and winds of up to 55 miles per hour. 90 kilometers per hour along the coast of Australia's most populous city and other parts of New South Wales state. The Bureau of Meteorology saying the downpour is expected to continue and may lead to flash flooding. Residents in a number of suburbs have been ordered to evacuate. Emergency services said they have carried out more than 100 flood rescues and responded to some 3,000 requests for assistance in the past 24 hours. Evacuation centers have opened in several areas of western Sydney. The Weather Bureau's Hazards Preparation and Response Manager Jane Golden said a coastal trough lingering since Friday depended while an east coast low pressure system formed over the mid north coast that's produced some extraordinary rainfall rates over the last 24 hours. Many locations have seen up to 200 mm 8 inches and some close to 300 mm. 12 inches, she said. The volume of rain is almost half of Sydney's annual average. People were told to avoid any non-essential travel, including on public transport, with some roads already underwater and others at risk of sudden flash flooding. New South Wales Minister of Emergency Services Steph Cook said, the worst of the weather system is expected to hit over the next 24 hours, and she urged residents to avoid travel even as school holidays begin in the state. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.